New Buffs basketball team experienced an incredible high when they beat Oregon, followed quickly by a disappointing low and a loss to Oregon State. As Eric Christensen explains, the Buffs going to rely on the reigning Pac-12 Player of the Week, McKinley Wright, to right the ship. Up top, ball deflected away, stolen by Gatlin, gives it up to Bay, on his way to the hoop, goes up strong, hit from behind, oh, the follow jam by McKinley Wright! In CU's upset of Oregon, McKinley Wright looked every bit like the Pac-12's player of the week. McKinley goes to work with a dribble. Hook pass high on the left side. Three days later, nothing changed. Through 33 minutes, Wright nearly had a triple-double against the Beavers. But those final seven minutes were a nightmare. McKinley turned it over three times as the Buffs lost a big lead and ultimately the game. I made a lot of careless reads down the stretch, uh, turned the ball over, and, you know, they came back striking at us. So um, it was disappointing, man. He certainly did not play well down the stretch. He knows that. You know, everybody that was here knows that. Um, you know, he had, and, and what's so disappointing, he had played so well, you know, for the first 33 minutes. I mean, he had, 30, he had 10 assists and no turnovers. The Buffs learned a valuable lesson against Oregon State last Sunday, and it's that McKinley Wright, their best player, may not always be there to bail him out. That sometimes somebody else may have to step up. When he struggles, uh, some, of, some of his teammates need to pick up. And just like when they struggle, he picks up. He, they, you know, it's, it's got to be a two-way street. I feel like... Ken is the most important piece on our team, and if he's not playing good, then someone has to step up. But uh, that game, I don't think no one stepped up. Of course, everyone needs a little help, but if the Buffs want to be dancing in March, they need McKinley to have the right stuff. It's a lot of weight on, my, um, on me and on this team as a whole. Um, you know, we know we got to bounce back. This program would not be in the position it's in without McKinley Wright, I can promise you that. In Boulder, Eric Christensen, CBS4 Sports. Not sure if McKinley's ever scored a basket quite like this one last night. Draymond Green did not mean to do this, although it looked really cool. It counted as a turnover, unfortunately. And look, here are my thoughts on this. The Warriors have won nine games this year, right? That's Can't it? the NBA just help them out, <laughs> let them count the basket? It wouldn't right. matter much. They lost by nine last night. For all the excitement they've provided over the years, give them Give them that one. Come there on. There are no gimmies, Michael. You can't have it. Thanks, buddy.